Welcome to Scale It Wait, how to add a new project. In this video we will show you how to add a new project for an existing customer. If we go up to the accounts page and select the customer you wish to add the project for from your list, here we'll select Mike Smith. Towards the bottom you'll see a projects tab. Go and click the add button right below that. This will allow you to input all the information about your project. The name is the only field that is required, however, we recommend you enter as much information as you have. One thing to note is when you enter the zip code, just press the return key or enter key and the city will be automatically populated. Some other important fields here is the order quantity. This is the quantity of the product that the customer ordered for this project. You also have a tax exempt check mark. If this project is tax exempt and that is checked, then there'll be no tax applied to this, to this project. We'll then select what product this project is for. If it's for multiple products, just leave that blank. Then we'll scroll through the other tabs at the top. You can add sub projects to projects. You can view details on the projects. The details section will show you how much is ordered, how much has been delivered, and the average weight of each transaction. So by saying OK, you have saved this project to that customer. We'll go ahead and uh, complete a weighing for you just to show you how the project is calculated. So we'll say add in the top left of the main software. Select the vehicle that is currently on the scale. And this vehicle belongs to Mike Smith. And it's going to automatically load all his information, including his one project you have. If there are multiple projects, they'll give you an option to select which project to choose from. So we're going to do the theme park project, and it will be for product number five, which is part of that theme park project. So we'll go ahead and enter some dummy weights here just so we can get some values. If you want to grab the current weight from the scale, just make sure the gross box is highlighted and you hit the enter key. Then to complete the ticket, go ahead and hit enter again. And that weighing has then been completed. So let's go back up to the accounts page and pull up Mike Smith again. We'll go down here and open up Mike Smith and then open up the theme park project we just created. You'll see now when we go into the details tab at the top, you'll see that we have calculated that he had just uh, purchased 4,160 pounds of that project. It will give you all the additional information regarding that project. Go ahead and say OK and close it out. That's how you add a new project into the Scale It Weight software. 